Fortnite's new update just dropped, and it's fucking bullshit. Everyone is getting FPS drops, everyone is getting stutters, and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to actually fix all of these issues. Now, the issue is with the performance mode and actually all of the shaders in the game. Fortnite has screwed up the way that shaders work. Basically, shaders are all of the beautiful effects on your screen, everything that you fucking see from the shadows to fucking effects. For some reason, Fortnite has managed to fuck it up so that it doesn't actually load pre-game, but it constantly loads again, 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 and again, which puts a strain on your PC, and then you get so much FPS drops and stutters because your PC is trying to compensate for the loading. All of performance more users have this problem, and today I'm gonna be showing you how to actually fix it. Don't use performance mode, use DirectX 12 and actually enjoy the game. Now I know you're not using DirectX because you have performance issues, FPS drops, generally don't get much FPS, but in today's video I'm going to be showing you how I managed to get a shit ton of FPS with DirectX 12. Now before we start the video, join the screen in the description or check out RedPeaks.com, that's the tweaks that we're going to be using today, but if you want a free alternative, you can check out the free tweaks channel in the Discord and get a pretty nice FPS boost. And the free pack gives you more FPS, the paid packs are going to give you 10 times more FPS, so just check out RedPeaks.com or join join the discord in the description as you can see this is the fps that i get on the currently highest settings possible as you can see everything is on epic everything is maxed out now this is the tool that i'm going to be using to fully optimize my pc and actually remove all of the stutters that i have in fortnite and at the same time boost my fps by a lot and really just enjoy the game so the first thing that i did is go to performance mode hardware and all of these settings i just optimized everything cpu amd apply i then went over to each and every one of my pc components and optimized every every part of a PC I have. Now, during tweaking, I wanted to show you the processes that I had before and after, and look at the fucking difference. After that, I decided to optimize my windows, selected Windows 10, and optimize my whole windows to get the best performance. Cleaned up all of the temporary files, debloated my fucking PC, then I disabled all of the unnecessary processes on my PC, disabled background services, did some power settings, used the custom power plan, did some windows tweaks, optimized all of my windows settings, optimized all of the apps that I use, Discord, Spotify, and even OBS which I use to record my videos. I then went to the game section, clicked on Fortnite, and clicked on optimize. Now Fortnite is not the only game in this utility, there are over 45 different games that you can optimize just like Fortnite. A ton of options, a ton of recommended settings, and the best optimizations. I then optimized my internet, optimized my internet adapter, reduced ping, and I went to optimize epic games for a faster download speeds and in general the best performance. Now in the input lag section, I removed my input lag, optimized my keyboard, mouse, devices, my USB ports, my controller, and everything that could be done. I then used the time resolution setting which removed my input delay by automatically picking out the best settings for time resolution and working in the background. I then went to the overclocking section and followed every guide that was there just to optimize my PC for the best performance. I then went over to the BIOS option and fully optimized my BIOS by tweaking all of the hidden settings. After that finished, I went over to the rip mode section, clicked on rip mode, apply, and I saved myself about 300 megabytes of RAM. I then went over to the crosshair section and picked out the best crosshair for my liking to fully become a Fortnite Pro. Now let's check the difference. Now as you can see, this is all of the same settings, everything is the same. Let's see the difference by using the best tweaks in the world. Now would you look at that, look at the FPS boost that we've managed to get with only using tweaks. Oh. Bye. That's about it. Thank you for watching the video. If you want to boost your FPS as well, ribteaks.com or join the Discord in the description.